Hey, it's me, Pro Jared. Welcome back to Matches of Gathering Chandelar Modern Edition, where we are currently going to go into the Red Castle, which I have not been in yet, so I actually don't know what to expect. But I made some tweaks to the deck. It's getting pretty thick. But we should be good. As I put a lot of cards in there, that's just a lot of red hate. Oh, jeez, if I can get in there before. <laughs> Many cards await outside. Uh, got Blood Crypt, Install Artifact, Island, Blue Elemental Blast. Yeah, I suppose. Only because I've got plenty of uh, removal to use immediately. I'll save myself two life. I don't need a Lightning Bolt. Anything they immediately put down. Oh, keep it chill. Keep it chill. Play out the Shaman. Let's at least get a threat on the board. Plus one Chasm Skulker. I tap this in such a way that I have a blue mana left over. Or should I have the... Nah, we'll do the blue mana, because that's a counter spell and a removal spell. Curd Chieftain. Yeah. Blue Elemental Blast! Blue counter spell. Then we got the Black Lotus. Who could I? <laughs> I could insult <laughs> in attack <number> five. <laughs> Don't think I won't. <laughs> also, what is this Black Lotus art? Curd ape. Who cares? End step. Um. Man, you know what? I got nothing else going on, so... Black Lotus, come alive! Attack 411? So close to dead. This is stupid. Okay. <laughs> yes! Black Lotus, kill! <laughs> Alright. Oh, yeah. Birds of Paradise in the next duel? Well then, bring it on, bitch. I got all these spells, plus extra mana? Check it. Swamp. Immediate build. Get a 1 1 out, I get to draw a card. I've got all kinds of shit going on. This dude doesn't stand a chance. Uh, just go Infiltrator. Oh. Nice birds of paradise. Uh, boy. I could confiscate birds of paradise. That's so unnecessary. But I could. Uh, let's, uh, uh, mystical tutor to find something. And then time walk into it. Hold on. Cruel ultimatum? Pretty close to that. Well, that's what I want. Uh, sure. We'll say that one. I don't know. Attack with both of these. And then I draw Cruel ultimatum. And then we time walk using the birds of paradise. I don't want to actually make the black lotus go off. I'm trying to be careful about that. Uh, we got the blue elemental blast. Can I find another minosaurs? Oh, it's murder. Uh, yeah, we'll pass back. Ground assault deals damage to number of land you control, which is three. Or I can just counter that with Blue Elemental Blast! No, save my Shadow Mage Infiltrator. And then we use the Birds of Paradise, tap for blue, and Ancestral Recall myself. Can I? The Birds of Paradise? Yeah, I guess I can, huh? So it's Black Lotus for three Swamp. 
Both my lands for blue. Birds of Paradise for the final red. Also got one extra swamp here. That also it. Okay, okay. Black Lotus. Black. Red. Red. Blue. Blue. You. Oh, you lose a crawl worm? You might as well scoop now, dude. Now you just don't stand a chance. Now I'm drawing a bunch of crap I don't care about. Man. Man. Land of Elves, Killer Bees. Wish I had <laughs> some better creatures. <laughs> yeah, of all the things I got going on. Uh, good creatures isn't one of it. Where are those bees? Let's put on another flying protection from red. Because this is supposed to be a red opponent. They're apes. There's lacking all the red sources. Uh, sure, I don't know. Can I kill you this turn? That's always the question. Not quite, but we getting there. Unless I top deck uh Lightning Bolt. Oh, Ow, Miri. If only you're here sooner. All right, I've sufficiently beat the shit out of you. Critter's Claws. Dragon Whisperer? It's a mythic rare. That's a 2-2 creature for two red. And for one red, it gains flying until end of turn. For one, a red gets plus one plus O oh until end of turn. So it's like a pseudo fire breathing. And then for six mana, formidable. Create a 4-4 red dragon creature token with flying. Activate this ability only if you... If creatures you control have total power, eight or greater. I kind of love that. Give me him. Her. Uh, hold on. Let me see the game first. All right. Red Castle, let's do it. No. Where'd you come from? Where'd you go? Where'd you come from? Con I Joe. I just want to get in the red castle and you're slowing me down. Did you have blue elemental blast right away? Keep a blue elemental blast and lightning bolt. Damage prevention. This is just. I think it's. I, this is originally interrupt, but they've uh, routed it to uh, instant. For the sake of this mod. Memory interrupts for cards. I forgot I could cast Gasm Skulker. It's fine. Oothden Troll. Blue Elemental Blast. Counterspell. <laughs> Uh, I guess we'll go with Skulker limbs start growing. Stone Giant? Oh, here we go. Black Lotus. Now I can play all the cards. Do I want to play any of them? I don't know if I need to yet. But I guess it's still kind of worth it, huh? Yeah, let's go straight into Dungeon Geists. Tap out the Stone Giant so the Stone Giant can't chuck anyone. We'll pass back, so I attack the Chasm Skulker, the... second Uh... Goblin Arsonist with a little block it and kill Chasm Skulker. All right, you're tapped out, and while you got no mana, I'm going to kill your regenerating troll. So all you got are a bunch of 1-1s. One
Back with the Geists. No, oh, there's 3 1. Uh, I think I want to keep Chasm Skulker back to block. Yeah. Well, now it's 5 5. Now let's keep back the Death Bridge Shaman to block. Here. Oh. Just take out the Death Bridge Shaman. But now I can kill you? Yeah, especially if I just go... Miri the Cursed. For the haste. So that's six damage in the air alone. Alright, god. Oh, Dark GL Citadel. This is actually a really fun card to put the uh, animate artifact on. Because it's an indestructible land, but now you have a 5-5 five, five land that's indestructible. Alright, let's do this. Actually, this time. Mana Flare is in effect. Okay, yeah, so it's just going to be constant ramp. So I do need to worry about them blasting out stuff like Earthquake, Disintegrate, Fireball. And all that. I'm finding a fair amount of dice I can use right away. If I could find some treasure on top of everything, that'd be even more exciting. Plus two life. Treasure. Just hidden behind a couple of goblets. Greed! Uh, tree name Nemesis. Oh, this is such a capable hand. Check this shit out. Thanks to Mana Flare, I can pay two life for Steam Vents, put down the Mox Jet, and then cast True Name Nemesis. Select a player, Goblin Lord. I now have a 3 1 protection from Goblin Lord. So, like, Will he even want to attack at all? Because this is just going to block and kill anything he has. Unless he starts... If he gets more creatures than me, he can overrun me. That is a possibility. We'll put out the Shadow Mage Infiltrator. That's another pretty good blocker. Nope, got Flame Flash. Bloodshot Trainee. Deals 4 damage to target creature. You can only do that if his power is 4 or more. Might just Black Lotus into a big old brain geyser right now. Yeah. Alright, let's Lightning Bolt. Uh, just your biggest guy. And then... You can Brain Geyser the rest. Yeah, for 6. Draw 6. Yep, we'll stay back to block. Okay. Lots of, lots of options. Let's go Blazing Spectre. Just love to start just ruining that hand. Itcha. Make it lose Immolation. Um, I can keep up mana for Blue Elemental Blast. Let's, uh, actually keep my life total up. Go back up to 18 life real quick. Just, just a little bit of life. That's a treat. My deck actually works better with, uh, Mana Flare. No, if I got Mana Flare, if this doesn't work out, I'll load the game and bring in my more expensive cards. Like, um, the D Tide of the Dark Realm, or the heck it was called. Or anything else that costs, like, Eight or more. Uh, if I go Crypt Gas, that's even more mana on top of that, which is ridiculous. Actually, yeah, let's bring him out. Because you're not, you can't block him. He's got protection. You'll lose your last card. All you have are a bunch of 1 1 goblins. I can leave up Mystical Tutor, I can leave up Murder, Blue Elemental Blast, all my instants. Double murder should have come to that. Lordling Outburst. Create three 1-1 one, one red goblins. Uh, I'm going to blast that, because that's frankly too many goblins. Uh, 
screen if you want as well. Uh, fire to oh, mystical tutor into cruel ultimatum. Lord knows I can cast that right now. Okay, again, I gotta be careful with my taps. Okay, so two red, um, two blue, black. You. Uh, just that. Is good. Creatures come back. Just shadow mage infiltrator. I got dark ritual. I got so much shit. All you got is a little goblin, and I'm gonna kill you. Right. There. Okay, one down. I'll have to get past that scroll. I'm gonna grab one more dice. Just to search. I'm gonna check down here too, because I might go to the Red Wizard. The Dreadbird Shaman. It does not. This is more dice. So wizard's gonna be potentially right here or somewhere in here. Which to get into here, I'm gonna have to go past this guy. Or I guess this could be a dead end here for something too, huh? I'm gonna greed that treasure though. I love profit. Oh, hell yeah. So one of the cards I actually put onto here was weak stone because I knew goblins were going to be a thing. This makes all attacking creature gets minus one, minus zero. Now it does weaken my creatures as well, but I find that to be a worthwhile cause to shut down basically all their goblins. Goblin focal band. Um, I got a lot of not helpful cards in my hand right now. Uh, yeah, let's go weak stone. Now, no one can attack. I can still attack for two. But you attack for none. Oh, I can insult the weak stone. <laughs> it comes together! Uh-huh. Okay, okay. Insular. The weak stone. Now the weak stone is the strongest. And attacks for four. Get him. Oh, all these blockers? Sure would be a shame if one of them got... Murder. Specifically your biggest dude. Boop. 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 There. Now you got nothing. Helm of Chatsuk. Give creature banding, Goblin King. Other goblins have plus one, plus one, and Mountain Walk. But I do have a Mountain Out. That's only for other goblins, which is currently none. I also got Lightning Bolt. Who gives a shit? Bzz. I just got a mana left over to bring out the Chasm Skulker. And then I'm going to start beating your face. Goblin Polka Band. Who cares? I have another murder just in case. Yeah, I'm okay with that. I'm okay with making them lose a card. Another Goblin Polka Band. Not good enough. I have a Blue Elemental Blast. Uh, If I murder, I attack in for six. Damn. Oh, I got nothing else to do with my mana. Murder. Ugh. Look at this. this is... It's like a dog who just like lost all his fur. And he's pissed. Hover me here. Oh. That's an artifact. I can't nuke that. She also can't stop me. Okay, now all I gotta do is answer this. What's the toughness of a crown Ceratok? I could picture it in my head. I wanna say four. I'm gonna look it up again. Sorry. You know I'm usually not about this. But also, like, 
Oh, three. I was close. It's a four, three trample. I was close. Three. All right, give me this treasure. Only 110 gold and only two jewels. That's not as exciting as I thought it was going to be. So now I've got a choice to figure out where the red wizard is. This is so suspicious. I feel like I got to check that. But I do have some extra dice I can grab to help boost me for those upcoming battles. So let's try those. I can also try checking past him. Plus three life. Let's check past this guy. Oh, there's a Black Lotus. He starts off with a Fire Drake? Well, now you start off with nothing. I can also Blue Elemental Blast the Mana Flare. That doesn't seem like a good use of my mana. I could play Ashling. It is a 4-4. Four, four. Yeah, that sounds good. Leave me with one island. The blue elemental blast. Whatever. Giant tortoise! It's a 1-4. Wait, you got blue? Oh, yeah. If you don't block, you're going to lose your tortoise anyway, so... Die. Cool magic. Uh oh. That's not a good. I have a way of getting that back. Do I? I don't have any bounce effects. I would have to kill it. And then maybe. Use my own control magic on it? Alright, I'm just gonna bring up the dungeon guys and tap it down forever. Seal of fire? It's sack it to deal two damage or something. To me? You dick. Lotus Eye Mystics. 3 2 Prowess. Switch the battlefield, return target enchantment card from your graveyard to your hand. From your graveyard. It's back seal of fire. Okay. Okay. I'm not getting any mana. Red specifically. I think I might need to Vampiric Tutor into some Steam Vents. Or the Bloodstained Mire into Steam Vents. Let's take the damage for now. Phantom Monster, a 3 3 flyer. Bloodfire Experts, a 3-1 Prowess. So they got a Prowess deck going on. I could... Blast... That. I got this Confiscate in hand with one more mana. I can Confiscate. How do I feel about that? Well, I know I need to do this. I mean, I could also find... Is it, does it matter that I really need, or is it just any other creature or spell? Because I could just go True Name Nemesis. That would also shut them down pretty hard. Is that the better choice? True name nemesis? It'll stop both the little ground attackers. Yeah, let's do him. And we'll blast that blood fire expert. All right, it's got three one protection from Keltosh. Force 
Protects it. I mean, he still had protection, so the damage didn't matter. Oh. Protection from white and can pump himself. Scary. Not expect her. It's at least another flyer. Still gonna play defensively. I have to worry about using Dungeon Geist to block the Phantom Monster. Because they'll die and they'll let Ashling untap. There's that heck and seal of fire. So he is threatening lethal. If I block there, I can kill that. You can pump him twice. That's a 4-4. Four, four. I could double block. Uh, now nah, we'll just throw him in the way. Yeah, I'll go down to one. God, oh my God. There's another protection from red. This is looking bad, though. All right, so protection from red blocks you. True name nemesis blocks you. And then I have to trade out here. There's murder. Which I'll pretty much have to use to take out my own Ashling. They can just draw like a lightning bolt and I'm dead. Okay, Ancestor Real Call, please. Can I get something to do? Uh, I have Blue Elemental Blast. And a Dark Ritual, okay. Well, since I got a mana for it, Blue Elemental Blast, that guy. I got nothing. I could have started attacking for five. He's down to seven. I hit cast eye for an eye and bounce the damage back to me. Okay. So I do kind of want to adjust the deck a little bit, knowing that's got mana flare going on in there. Leave me alone, guys. Don't just. I have 1800 gold. Don't you want something from me? I want to go change my deck real fast so I can. Get all my, my bigger spells out there. Don't be a dick. Alright, boom. True name nemesis. Can't kill me. Pikeman? I don't give a shit. Let me tap down your stupid pikeman. Bloodfire experts. More like bloodfire dumb. Got him. Can't kill me. Ooh, land tax? Classic. Um, blue elemental blast. You die. Oh, I still gotta make you sack a creature. Okay, there you go. Uh -huh. Alright. So, knowing that the mana flare is a thing, what could I do? Or bring in that'll just uh, allow me to capitalize off of that. Now stuff like Dark Steel Citadel wouldn't be too bad. Just like more expensive. Like this essentially only costs three. Sort of. 
Uh, we could bring in that Dragon Whisperer. Like, I'll have the mana just to pump into it. Um... I wonder if I should actually go up one more land. I know, that sounds weird, but I'm getting towards a 60 card deck and I basically have... Well, that's a count around, like, was it 20 mana sources? Not that this does a great job of properly counting that. Um, like, anything that just sinks mana. Bring in the second Miri. Yeah, another Miri? Sure. That sounds good to me. Oh, wait. That, that uh, second Dark Knight. The uh, get all creatures back. Rise of the Dark Realms. Why not? It could be funny. Alright. Let's see if that, uh, that little tweaks doesn't help. Just get the fuck out of my way. Why can't I pay money for people to leave me alone anymore? What's the point of having money if I can't use it to tell people to leave me alone? Okay. Where's my blue? Uh, where's my blue? There's my blue. Okay. In your life. Uh, where do I want to start? Uh, let's just blast this guy. Get two for one, bitch. Critter's claws deal four to me? God, everyone's such a dick. Oh, uh, Black Lotus. Um... Uh, let's do Baleful Strix. Draw a card. Island. I don't know if I want to confiscate that, but I could. Yeah, I might just chill for a second. Ground Assault. Uh, no, you can kill the Strix. That's fine. It's only a 1-1. Mediocrity just to quick gain some life because at least they're missing land drops. Okay, here, Miri, get the cursed. Right, take this. Now, if you actually play something worth a damn, I'd take it. Birds of Paradise? Not quite. Uh, oh, is it Charm? One red, one blue. I swear it's only drawing one card. It's supposed to draw two cards, then discard two, right? I just drew a swamp. Yeah, I don't think that's actually working right. Hmm. Brute force to birds of paradise? Damn, I didn't see that coming. Fucking got me, dude. Oh my god. Fire breathing on birds. Okay. Uh, time walk. Take this. That's fine. Kills you. Gets a card out of your hand. My hand sucks, so I don't care about it. Draw. Lightning bolt. Balls. Gloom Widow, 3-3 three, three reach. 3-3 three, three dead. Mana. And I was just saying, maybe I should put more mana in here. I'm sorry I said anything.
Well, we got the insult. Sorry, what do you do again? Oh, Seth Dutch. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Right. Ah, oh, cruel ultimatum, thank god. Oh uh, fuck. Okay. I, yay. Oh, you lost Erebos? Uh let's return Miri. Mountain. Ooh, here we go. Dark ritual. Blazing Spectre. So I got one red mana left over. Doesn't matter. Take this. You got one. Now that was a match. It disintegrate. The Suba may have into the battlefield. Taps a copy of a land on the battlefield. That's kind of cool. All right, come here. Give me your treasures. Hopefully, this dungeon will be as kind as the last one, with in terms of dice and sense of direction. Hello. Oh. Oh, this one looks way more confusing. Hello? Oh. Hello? Hello? Check down here. Anything in here? No. This way is looking like it might be some jam. I'm convinced this goes to nowhere, but there is some free dice. Cadaver Imp. You know what? It is a creature. Um, I get more possibilities this way, although this looks like it might be towards an actual thing. Let's deal with this guy first. Mountain, Ruby, Swamp. Gives me five total mana. Murder and blue cards. I'll get a blue source. And he was never heard from again. Just kidding, bitch. You doubted me. Uh, just time walk right away. Like that put the ruby down. Uh, yeah, time walk me. Take this, got him. Okay. Go swamp. So I could drop the Shadow Mage Infiltrator. I could, I mean, I have Blue Elemental Blast, but it's not looking like it's going to hit anything exciting. Unless I just blast that man Mana Flare, which I could, because I wonder if that's good enough to slow down the opponent's game plan. How do I feel about that, though? Actually, I might wait a turn, because I kind of want to have a big old brain geyser for myself. Are you attacking your 1-1 one, one into my 1-3? You already spent all your mana. Um, take that. Alright. Sick, dude. Uh, Bloodstained Mire helps me find land. Might actually need to blow a mental blast him. Because he is a 4 4. Uh, well, let's see if I, let's see what I draw. Hypnotic Spectre, not bad. Let's activate the Bloodstained Mire. We'll find the Watery Grave. Untapped. Okay, yeah, we'll do both. So. Oh, blast it, and then spend the rest of my mana on a Brain Geyser. Because I still get four cards. Wait, 
What's happening here? Sure. Yeah, you really got me. Okay. Now I got some shit. There's the Dragon Whisperer. Will's got Is It Charm to blast one of these guys. I think I'd rather get more threats out. Uh, okay, do a little bit of both. Uh, I don't want to do the draw two, discard two, because I, I don't think it works. So let's do deal two damage to your bees. So I still have two mana left over. I can go Hypnotic Spectre by tapping one Swamp and using up my one more blue. Spectre is now out. And I can tap the Mox Ruby. Cast the Dragon Whisperer. Good. I can fuck you up a little bit. Pass back. Another Bird's Paradise. And at this point I'm just going to Kill your blockers. Just... One more mountain. So can you... So only... I only activate this ability if you can... Creatures control have a total power 8 or greater. Total. I'm at 6. I don't think I'm getting any more. That's fine. Could draw something. Or murder. Is this sorcery speed or instant? Oh, dude, that's instant speed? That's nuts. So I can do that whenever I want. Alright, your lightning bolt. I'm good. Do what you want. Oh. Insult artifact. Allows Mox Ruby to give me enough power for a dragon whisperer to start making dargons. That's a lot of power. I guess I could also just kill him. Because I'm hitting for a lot. Oh. Okay, which guy back here? More dice. Oh, mm, they might just wrap around. I don't think there's a guy right here, so this looks like nothing. Down this way, though, yes. Maybe off in these little directions. Can I solve this? Requiem Angel. I don't know, dude. I don't want to spend an hour and a half in here. Doing every single fight. Toughness of Requiem Angel? Five. Alright. I checked my memory. There's the Red Wizard. I can go right for her. Try to find some treasure. Plus one life. I hope it's a little bit more than that. So if I defeat them, that's two dice I could use for her. Plus a third dice if I answer these riddles. Now let's take out this guy first. Has Brothers of Fire? I don't know what that is. Okay, Blood Crypt Mox Ruby gives me three mana into Dreadbird Shaman. There's Dark Steel Citadel in there. My auntie's Olivia. That's a bummer. But outside of the brain guys, I've got a playable hand. Okay, just immediately hit me for five. Neat. I also got Watery Grave, which allows me to play Shadow Mage Infiltrator, which sets up a blocker. Whereas Shaman. If Brothers of Fire can just kill. Yeah, I'm gonna have to take some pain. Ruby. Go Infiltrator. Oh, wait, I don't have the man for Infiltrator. Because this is both my blue and my black source. Rip. Alright. This guy it is. Seal of Fire to myself and him. Get him to discard Tithe. I'm getting low on life already. He. It's fine. Now I can go Shadow Mage.
Whoops. Don't blast me. I'm taking destroy target artifact or enchantment. Destroy the Mox Ruby. That's not that bad. I need to kill that stupid Brothers of Fire because he's dealing one damage to me every turn. Okay, Shadow Mage, find me a card. Rise of the Dark Realms. Okay, we'll use the dungeon guys to at least tap it down. You can still activate it. But at least this way I can play in the Blood Crypt tapped. Try to save myself on some life. Oh, you can activate that twice per turn. So I'm just dead then, right? Outside of uh, Brain Geysering into Blue Elemental Blast or um, Lightning Bolt. Damn it. So I could go Blood Crypt for one more draw, leave up a red mana, just in the small chance I get a Lightning Bolt. Or I can just tap my mana for me, which is not what I wanted. It did it for me. It fucked up. Alright, cool. Thanks, game. Well, let's see. Maybe I'll draw an island and blue blue elemental blast. I got the drowned catacomb. And is it charm would have done it? All I can do is fucking die. Oh you lightning bolt me anyway. Mm. Trying again. Don't I don't wanna fucking fight you, dude! Just go away. Why won't they leave me alone anymore? I'm annoyed. Alright. Alright. Watery Grave. Pay two life. Mox Ruby. Dark Ritual. Olivia. Two Curd Apes? Let's take Meyer. Uh, lightning bolt one. Take this. Eaten by spiders. Destroy a target creature with flying. Okay. Where's my blood? <laughs> Just cast the frickin' spell. Just make them lose cards. I'm still a mana short for this. Wait, one, two, three, six, seven. Two short, sorry. Alright, brain guys are for a billion. I kind of wanted to find something that will stop this curd ape. I'm going to keep that back a blocker in case he's got some kind of pump effect. Um, now I can play Neferox, I can soul an artifact. I can play the Darksteel Sentinel and then just soul him and have a 5-5 Vigilant Indestructible. Surprise! 
Yeah. Insol. Yeah, now he's a 5-5 five five with Vigilance and Indestructible. Take this. Um... Gotta keep putting out creatures. And with Lightning Bolt, I've got Lethal. So, five. Bzzzt. Just stay off the block, out of my way, so I can destroy your master. Oh my god, just let me in the fucking dungeon. Ah, mulligan that hand. That's not much better. I could at least have some murder. And one more land gives me Miri. Alright. Murder's ready. 1-3 prowess? You're not that scary. I say as I get nothing. Second one. Uh, okay. Search your library for a planes card. If target opponent controls more lands than you, you may search for additional planes. I don't. So you're just getting one planes. Well, I guess I'll murder one. Save two points of life. Hello? Ariel Island? Do dungeon guys, because that stops attacks. I can go Miri next turn. Seal of Cleansing? Destroy target, artifact, or enchantment. So you could destroy my Mox Jet. You're a butthole. Which is a damn shame, because I just got install artifact. There it goes. Spike man. Yeah, it's six damage in the air every turn. You're dead next turn. Fire elemental. And death. Animar, Soul of Elements? Protection from white and black. I've never seen that guy before. He's kind of cool. I don't want Tempest to free. Wow. Let me in. Okay. For realsies this time. Oh, you get Olivia next duel. Perfect. Make a count. Let's, this is the worst dungeon layout yet. Ponder. I just need to get past these guys first. Well, I got this Olivia. Let's make a count. Maybe we can find some shit. Yeah, I'm just gonna go straight to murdering. In for three. Yep, they had their own lightning bolt back, which I figured as much. Uh, Crypt Ghast. Because he's like even further mana ramp. Smoke. Oh, not that. Earthquake for four. Am I have the blue elemental blast, the stupid smoke? Well, my hands aren't looking very good. At least I can get a creature out for nothing. Okay. No time lock. Okay, so if I hit the time lock, I should vampiric tutor into something. Like, um... Let's get the protection dudes, huh? True name elemental? Or true name nemesis? This will make it so I'm just protected forever. Arc trial. Ow. I'm the five. Um.
Mystical Tutor and Shadow Mage Infiltrator is a thing. I'm getting pretty low on life. Let's see, yeah, Mystical Tutor into... I'll just do a Lightning Bolt. Set so, so me off up for lethal. And spend the rest of my mana on my Infiltrator. Second mana flare. Untap my last dude. Get extra lightning bolts. Attack with everything. And I got two lightning bolts and two red mana. Okay. Treasure? Don't get greedy, Jared. Not worth it. Plus one life. Uh, I'm gonna try to hold on to those dice for her. Uh, that is a shockingly vanilla opening hand. Oh, frickin' Bone Splitter immediately hits me for three? Mm. Just tap Blood Crypt. I'll stabilize, it's cool. What is it, Kaisel Apprentice? As long as it's equipped, it gets plus one, plus one flying. That is a 4 2 flyer. Okay. Um. Mary is her first strike. I need to be on defense right now. Oh, Sky Knight Legionnaire. Classic. Looks like my first strike and is holding the mech. I land, I have six total mana. I could play Hypnotic Spectre and Cadaver Imp. I could also go Murder and Hypnotic Spectre, which I'm kind of leaning towards, just because there's a lot of shit on their side of the field. Yeah, let's do that. Murder. What does this give them? Plus two, plus oh. Let's say the Sky Knight Legionnaire. That's always flying. Let's put out another flyer. Archon of Justice! When Archon of Justice dies, exile target permanent. It's a 4 4 flyer. Cool! Let's just um, tap it down forever? Eh. There. Um. Let's hang out for a bit still. Still hanging out. <laughs> Goblin Tunneler. Target creature's power two or less can't be blocked this turn. That could be trouble. I did get this murder. Might need to murder that stupid Tunneler. Because I see the plan. But don't want him to have it. Alright, here's a 2-3 protection from red. Or if I murder the 4-2 flyer, I can start getting in with my flyers, which is all of them. I'm still feeling just a little scared. How about I go, mm, uh, no, we'll chill. Up and go smoke. Re-equips stone splitter. Okay, yep, just what I thought. Moves bone splitter back, that's... An actual, like, game plan. I hate it. Yeah, we gotta kill that tunneler. I'm scared of attacking with Miri, because the first strike is what's stopping these guys down there, because... I guess move that bone splitter around. Well... I'm gonna send just the him knock specter at him. Was that? Plus three, plus seven, first strike? Okay. Well, I got the last card out of their hand. And it just allows me to cadaver and back the Hypnotic Spectre. And then play the Hypnotic Spectre again right away. Oh, you used your smoke trying to untap your Archon, but you can't because it's got Dungeon Geist. You, you fool. Another Kite Sail Apprentice. I have Time Lock. 
So I'm gonna attack some dudes. Time walk. Get the blue elemental blast. Yeah, that would allow me to start stopping the stupid smoke effect. In for four. But so long as the smoke effect is confusing the opponent, I'd rather not. I was blue elemental blast the trying to kill Miri. Just say no to that. Island. Hell yeah, okay. Oh no, another flame slash shit. That's really bad. I kinda need that first strike. I sell the protection from Brad at the very least. And hopefully a very confused opponent. Yeah. It's not untapping properly. Another flame slash? Must be nice top decking everything you ever wanted. Quick gain ten life. Yeah, now the Archon is untapped. That's very bad. Uh, okay. Cave people? Confiscate. Take the 4-4 flyer? Or that fucking bone splitter. Mine. Okay. Back in it. What does cave people do? Target creature gains mountain. Oh, mountain walk? But that's... I have a mountain. Oh, fucking... Mm. Okay, Ancestor Recall. Draw three cards. Vampir Tutor. Ruby. Swamp. A Vampir Tutor into a fucking cruel ultimatum. Take this, and now I get to exile your stupid cave people. <sighs> Bitch, okay. Vampire Tutor. Cruel ultimatum. Eh. You. I get back. Miri. And I draw. All kinds of cards. I also got Brain Geyser. Alright, let's just bring out my hasty boys. And then I'm just gonna fucking... Boop. 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 Die. There! Jesus Christ! I right, grab another dice. Plus one life. Not getting real good rolls on those life. Alright. Can I get past this guy? Stop the Brothers of Fire again, which sucks. I do have murder. And enough mana for Dark Steel Sentinel and Neferox. Gotta take my lickens for now. Okay. Box Ruby. Which means I can go two life into Water Grave. Mox Ruby. Murder. So he can't be pinging me every turn. Lotus Path Jin, 2 3 Flying Prowess. Fuck. I can go up to 5 mana, insult the artifact, and start attacking in. Which might be the play. I kind of need to start threatening him more than he's threatening me. I can play this tapped. Okay. Now I can cast Neferox. 
which will give Exalt to my Mox Ruby, so now it's attacking as a 6-6. Six, six. Watch on to 8. Soul Cleansing. Destroy the Mox Ruby, that's fine. Second attack with Nephrox. Make you sack the Jin, get in for 6. Play Black Lotus, and then I got all kinds of stuff to play. Particle Sorcerer. Nope. I sent it off for 3 3. Gain some life just in case. Okay. The path is clear to the Red Wizard. Alright, let's just grab this dice and hope it's something super good. Deathbridge Shaman. Uh, at least it's a creature. And then here we heck and go. Hope for the best. This episode's already gone too long. I'm so sorry. 38 life. Nothing. I've got a turn one Baleful Strix. I also got Vampiric Tutor. And you have a Fire Grid. Okay. So we're going to go Island, Mox Jet. I could also go the Shadow Mage Infiltrator if I want to start attacking drawn cards that way. I think I hate this enough. I guess it's only a, it's only a 2-2, two -two, because I'm going to be activated once per turn. That's not that bad. So if I swing in and block, I at least get a card out of their hand. I guess. You lose Bathe and Dragonfire. Sick. And I'll... Well, let's go to the Shadow Mage Infiltrator. Let's start attacking in. Bloodstained Mire. It's pretty good. So I can use that to go straight into a Blazing Spectre. Because then I can take a card out of her hand and I'll draw one. You lose Sudden Demise. And I got the Shooting Nemesis. Okay, that's protection from you. Second Mana Flare. Okay, now we're getting out of control. So now my Lance Tap for three. So... If I could keep destroying her hand, it may not matter. I should have played Neat the Curse first, I forgot. I'll draw a card, you lose Mishra's Workshop. Alright, so... True Name Nemesis. Protection from the Dragon Lord. I still have... Three, six, seven mana left over. Uh, Nephorox? Please don't have a board wipe. Will you see the falling star? When it dies, deal five damage to each creature without flying. That's pretty good. I got an idea. Vampiric Tutor, we're going to find Cruel Ultimatum. Because I can cast this. And then what we'll do is I can attack with everything. I'm basically going to ruin their whole hand. Take out Ryusei. True Name Nemesis and Shadow Mage Infiltrator will die. But he'll have nothing. Oh, that's flying. Heck, well, I'll fuck that up. Oh well. And then, Krill Ultimatum? You! You lose Bogarden Hellkite? 5-5 five, five, Flash Flying? Oh jeez. Where's the battlefield deal 5 damage divided as you choose amongst any one of creatures or players? Holy shit! Oh, I'm almost gonna get back Mephorox. And I just hit the mana for Blue Elemental Blast, which allows me to stop her from doing anything. Looking good, Jared. Thank you.
Let me read the cursed. That is so much heck and mana. It's actually almost too much to deal with. Bring in the Baleful Strix so I can draw another card. Um, Nephorox. Attack everybody. I think I got her, dude. You're down to 13. Glimmer Pulse. You gain one life for each Locust on the battlefield. Just none. Unless you count as one. Nope. No, you still got one life. That's not good enough. Murder. I can attack everybody and you die? Oh, that was Xaxes too! You have to feed the dreaded red wizardess. Alright! Take any red card you want. Red card if I want. Is there a crawl worm? Duh. I well, I didn't mean Chandra's Fury. Four damage to target player and one damage to each other target player controls. No, no, this is what I need to do. I need to think of what red cards will help me the most versus stupid, stupid, stupid Black Castle with the Hypnotic Spectres always showing up and hitting my hands. Like, what's the best way just to deal with that? I could just grab a bunch of shocks to replace the uh to replace the the blue elemental blasts as a means of quickly taking them out. Uh I don't know. Alright, I'll think about this. I'll choose the cards and let you know in the next episode because I will be here for like another 30 minutes. This episode's already gone on long enough. And we just defeated the Red Wizard, so we're getting towards the end. Oh boy, okay. As always, thank you guys so very much for watching. See you next time!